Uh, my name is Staff Sergeant Matthew Little. My career field is uh, contracting. So the way I heard about this program was a, an email from my command section, the kind that you typically just gloss over and delete, send straight to the trash. Uh, and I started reading it and was like, oh my goodness, this is an incredible opportunity. Uh, I met all of the requirements. I have always thought that I could be a physician. There's always been an interest. Uh, I just never really had the opportunity. And so once I saw this program, I thought what an incredible you know, pathway into, into this career. Okay, so the day that I found out I was accepted uh, was actually the day before the public release was, uh, was made public. I was getting ready to go TDY down to Fredericksburg from Andrews Air Force Base. Uh, my superintendent, uh, E8, comes down and asks me you know, when I'm leaving for my TDY, when I was going to be taking off, and I told him later that evening, he says, okay, and he walks away. And I'm like, okay. And he comes down like 20 minutes later and says, I need you to come with me to talk to uh, Miss Hare. She's the uh, top civilian in my office. So I go up to her office and she's asking me generic questions about my TDY, where I'm staying, what the class is for, all this stuff, and I'm just like, this is kind of a weird interaction that I'm having with her. Uh, so then the, the colonel comes in, the director of contracting, and he says, Miss Hare, the general is, is in my office and she wants to see you. Little, you can, you can come too. Um, so then I walk out into the, into the uh, office there and the general, uh, General Dunbar, Major General Dunbar, now retired, she's sitting on a chair and she's got her hand, in, her hand on her face and she's just like, I, I just don't feel very well. And her executive is like, well, you know, what's wrong? You, you sick? And she says, yeah, I'm just not really feeling very well. If only there was a doctor in the house. And then they all turn and give me this silly grin and I was just like, <gasps> Oh my goodness, you know, I, I couldn't stop smiling for probably half an hour at least. Uh, it was a pretty incredible moment. I don't know if there's a better opportunity out there than being paid to go to school the whole time. You know, a lot of us come into the military to get school paid for in one way or another, and this is far and away the, the best program I've ever seen. Uh, I think the partnership between USU and George Mason is uh, pretty incredible. They both seem to have our uh, best interests at heart. Um, you know, we'll have m mentorship from USU and guidance, and then over at George Mason, they will do everything in their power to make sure that we succeed. You know, with a class size of 10, <laughs> we're practically getting tutored by our professors, and that's just incredible. The thing I'm looking forward to most is being able to have a tangible impact on the warfighter to get that sort of personal satisfaction knowing that I'm there helping those that have you know, given some, if not all, uh, in service to this country will be a very humbling opportunity and uh, I'm pretty excited about that.